Okay, so we need to cover um, Roman numerals a little bit. You don't need to know a lot of Roman numerals in here, but you need to know a few. And the reason I'm a little surprised at that is because we've already gone over that a little bit when we look at the periodic table. Remember those Roman numerals at the top of the table here? That's what? Roman number what? 1A. That's 2A. 3B. Well, there's 4 right there. IV is 4. Okay. 5 is a V. 6 is VI. 7 is VII. There's no real trick to it. 8 is VIII. The V's, the V's five, right? Yeah, V's are 5. So, I's are single digits. Okay. V is a 5. X is a 10. Well, I'm getting to that. Okay. If you put a smaller, if you put a smaller digit letter, smaller digit letter in front of a larger digit not digit letter, you subtract. If you put the smaller digit letter after a larger number, you add. So that makes that I V. I put the I, which is smaller, in front of the V. We subtract. That's a four. If I put the V followed by an I, then the smaller smaller number follows the larger number. You add them together, that's a 6. Okay? So what is this going to be? 9. But this is going to be 11. Okay? That's all that's to it, right? That's pretty much it. Uh -huh. Now, on the Super Bowl name... You've got an L. You don't have to know that in this class, but L stands for 50. Okay? But they don't got a 50 No, but they did subtract. They did subtract. They put an X in front of the L to show that's a smaller digit number, 10, subtracted from the larger digit number, 50. That's where you get the 40 from. Okay? Got that? Yeah, thank you. Uh-huh.